This video is a three-part demonstration taking place at the City of Calgary Fire and Safety Training Academy in Alberta. This live event was specifically coordinated by DSPA Flame Guard Limited to fulfill a special request by Correction Services Canada to demonstrate the deployment of an established fire suppression knockdown tool known as the DSPA-5, or Dry Sprinkler Powdered Aerosol Generator. In this first demonstration, best described as a real-life scenario, the Calgary Fire Commander pulls the ignition starter pin and deploys the DSPA-5 into a fully engaged steel shipping container consistent with the standard room dimensions in a CSC facility. Following the initial deployment, CSC's Regional Fire and Safety Training Officer yep. Sheldon Barker ensures the infrared cameras recording the fire's heat signature as displayed in the picture-in-picture -picture incorporated in the top right corner of this video. Within 12 seconds after deployment, the DSPA-5 is performing optimally, showing volumetric expansion of the aerosol cloud inside the enclosure. Within one minute, the infrared camera is indicating the room temperature has dropped dramatically. Concluding the first test of the DSPA-5, officers of the Calgary Fire Department Command bring water hoses to the building to douse remnant heat and flame activity following the fire's knockdown. The DSPA suppression technology is specifically designed as a tool to buy precious time for first responders before water and foam are delivered to the scene. In the second of the three-part test, fire command officers ignite fire fuel within a larger container room and prep the scenario for the second DSPA-5 activation and deployment, which is once again followed through with infrared heat sensor and video capture viewable at the top right corner of the screen. Again, this footage is demonstrating an effectively operating suppression tool dispersing within eight seconds following activation and expenditure of the dry aerosol followed by recorded temperature reduction and full containment of the fire. This test is made with the container door open to show the volume of aerosol which is seen ventilating rapidly. Correctional Service Canada's Regional Fire and Safety Training Officer Sheldon Barker describes his direct hands-on experience and interpretation of the Test 2 event. In our third test, we've taken our infrared camera into the back of the test container to show the discharge and effectiveness of the DSPA-5 with less rapid ventilation. 
This best reveals the fire's temperature ranges preceding the deployment of the DSPA-5. Within eight seconds of activation, the DSPA-5 begins to disperse the volumetric expansion agent, and within 50 seconds, the temperature of the fire begins to drop. Yellow fading to white, displaying the efficiency of the suppression qualities of the DSPA-5. Being inside the room enclosure capturing the event with an infrared camera and accurately measuring the changes in the fire's heat signature is a perspective rarely witnessed by fire industry professionals. For the fire and life safety industry, the dependability and reliability of the DSPA technology are critical qualities when deciding best practices in preserving and best protecting lives and property. This demonstration concludes thanks to cooperation and support from Calgary Fire and Safety Training Academy, officers of the Calgary Fire Departments, and staff of Correctional Services Canada. Concluding the third test, Correctional Service Canada's Regional Fire and Safety Training Officer Sheldon Barker provides his description of the DSPA 5's performance.